Good evening. This evening we're going to be cooking Norwegian scallops with a lovely risotto with spinach. It's delightful. Over here, please, ingredients. First, we have nicely, finely diced shallots and some crushed garlic. Zoom in here, come on. Right, okay. Right, and we got some fine aborio rice here. Right. Olive oil, which we'll be frying off the shallots and garlic in. And we got some nice salted butter here from France, and some fine Parmesan cheese from Italy, and some lovely mascarpone cheese from Ireland, and actually everything's from Ireland. This is the white wine we're going to cook with. It's lovely Bordeaux, French, Chateaubriand, Connex. It's a fine wine. You can taste a little here now. And like I say, if it's not good enough to cook with, or to drink, it's not good enough to cook with. Mmm, delightful. So first, we start with some olive oil in the pot. Next, you can smell that now, it's starting to smoke. We're going to eat our shallots. I'm going to swell it off very quickly. Daniel, garlic. Now you can see the shallots are sweating off here nicely. And we add our garlic in, which is nicely crushed. Okay, very good. A lovely aborio rice here. In we go, and we want to mix that around. Okay, give it a good lash. What we got over here boiling? Come over here. There's some chicken stock we made earlier today. So our chicken stock's boiling. You have to have chick hot stick chicken stock when you're cooking risotto. So white wine, please. The French one, the same we said. In we go. And now you can see. Look. It's starting to soak up all that white wine, instantaneously. Very good. Now we start to add in our chicken stock. One, let's just pour it in here now, because it's a big pot. Half of that, look, bring it in. We cover it up here. You can see it's starting to bubble up nicely. And you can hear that. Listen. It's starting to soak up all that lovely juice, fresh chicken stock. So it's nearly ready for the second lashing of fresh chicken stock or as the French say bouillon but who cares what the French say after all the stock now is incorporated into the burrito rice then we're going to add some fresh lovely salted butter some mascarpone cheese and some freshly grated parmesan then at the end we're going to put in nice fresh chives chopped up and lovely fresh spinach. See, baby spinach. Tastes great, massive. We'll give it a squeeze of lemon, right? And salt and pepper, of course. What we have here is some lovely, fresh, meaty scallops all the way from Norway. They smell, you can still smell the sea off them. What we're gonna do with these now is season them with some salt and pepper. Don't be afraid to over season them because when you cook them, you're going to lose at least 50% of the seasoning in the pan. There we go. So now we're going to start to fry our scallops. All we want to do with the scallops is we want to make a clock out of them. Season side down. One, two, three, four. You get the message clock. When you get around to the end, they're all cooked, okay? There we go. You can cook them now. They're nicely browning now, yeah? Put a bit of olive oil in there. Lovely stuff. Frying up, fabulous, okay? There we go. One, two, three. Scallops. This is the most difficult part. You don't want to overcook this food. This is the key ingredient. So I've got the scallops in there. Next, right? Bring over here. They're browning nicely. Put them in risotto, la. Lots of chives in there, okay? Nice for the butter, fresh butter in there. Parmesan cheese, lots of it. Fresh spinach, lots of it. Don't worry if it's a bit wet, it'll make it more moist, you know? Fresh mascarpone cheese in there, lots of it. Now so we're gonna get a nice bit of salt and pepper over the scallops here. Now look, 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 look. They're browning up nicely. They're half cooked already. Don't be scared to over season them because we're going to turn them. 
just start to mix all this up together nicely look at that now all melting in together I've turned the heat off now I've turned the heat off get all that ingredients pulled in together here we go now we turn the heat back on in the risotto all right nicely brown nicely brown nicely brown start to brown a little bit more here so it's gone up to nicely browning already Dan's going to add more salt on the risotto because it's slightly too sweet and some fresh chive and a bit of acid here lemon juice here Here, follow me with the scallops so. off. Yeah. come down, come down. Yeah, Take it to the table. Okay, here we go. Lovely scallops, white and risotto, and spinach. Thank you.